when I have no replica, I have to use this kind of material, which is a polarized filter, but it's inside the replica. Uh, I have to have a, a shade guide, gray shade guide, like the white balance. So, and in the replica, you have al already that. And I have to have this kind of material. So, a camera, good one, macro lens, ring flash. So, many, many uh, things. But now, only with the replica, I can have all the information and it's enough. So, we have to take the shade and uh, we can directly on the replica now see what kind of shade is it. I can see here directly on the screen the shade. So, it's 1M2, the information. And now, I just have to have a, a picture of the face. So, my patient must be completely parallel of that. And I have to see my eyes in the eyes of the patient. Because if I am like that, my pictures are completely wrong. And if I am on here, it's completely wrong too. And of course, this area are not good, this area are not good. So, of course, one thing is very difficult, is uh, my patients have to smile. And normally they don't want to smile because they have some trouble with the teeth and they don't want to smile. So, we have to relax the patient. I'm going with my camera and be completely parallel. This lens is parallel of my compare plant. So, my compare plant, here, 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 here is a Frankfurt plane, like that, from for plane, and you are completely right here. Here is my compare plane, and I need a picture on the compare plane. We take the picture like that, and me, one solution, you, you can make a joke, of course, but um, one solution is also uh, try to come down on to nine to, to one. Perfect, nice, perfect thing. Yeah, can you do the same uh, on, on China language? Uh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, y I have it. Very easy to to to. You try. If they can do, you 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 find another language. At the end, you have a smile, and I have to catch a real smile. So I take several pictures, tac 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 tac, and I just catch. Not the bigger smile, but on the good area of the smile, in fact. And this is the perfect thing for my uh, smile designer. Yeah. And I think we have enough information now. We can directly go and uh, put all the information in the, the computer. We are going now on this area. At first, we have two pictures of the smile. I can adjust also and take another picture with a retract smile. So, these two pictures are going in the software, so I can use Keynote if I want, but I can also use Smile Designer Pro. And with Smile Designer Pro, I have after the possibility to have the different kind of uh, <coughs> database with different kind of morphology. I choose the right morphology, I synchronize it directly, so, I can correct all this line, correct the form, big, bigger or less. I have all the possibility for that. So, this is my first work on my 2D Smile Designer. I see the effect of that on the natural smile and the retract smile. This is on the retract smile. Here I am in the reality because uh, I know exactly uh, the symmet symmetry or not of the Gangiva. Here it is not, you see. I have the information that my tooth here is small and this one is longer. So I have to be careful about that if I want to symmetrize. So I choose my line on a better world. This is the central, this is the lateral canine are on this area about the gangiva. This line are good. I try to do quite the same on this 
part, but you know, we need to make something with the Gangiva. So this is one thing to share with the patient about the possibility to, uh, to make more Gangiva here or not. Does she want or not? If she doesn't want, doesn't matter. We know, we know that this area can be a little uh, longer than the other. And we have simulation inside. So we have, in fact, different kind of shade. And I can correct that shade to have such a more good result. This simulation has to be not on this picture, so I have to go back. But on the picture of the smile, here, yes, I have it. So here is the first proposal simulation. And I can adjust the area, the form, of course, step by step and one piece by one. So for me, it takes quarter um, or 10 minutes, but not more to, to do that. You see, <coughs> I have a first proposal, but it's too bright. So I have the possibility to correct the information. And with this correction, I have the possibility to share with the patient about uh, does the shade be more white and more bright. I can also uh, have the line guide and to see if my proposal are good or not. So this is a 2D simulation. Uh, make only with two pictures.